Hey guys, welcome to another video. I'm Amy. If you're new to my channel, I talk about health and raw food, fitness, spirituality, and personal development. Today, the topic is worry. Don't worry about a thing. <laughs> One of my favorite songs, uh, if you're um, familiar with Bob Marley, which like almost everybody is, is Three Little Birds. Like... <laughs> It's such a great song. Like when you when you when you sing it, when you when you hear it, you just instantly in a good mood, and you forget about any worries. And like that's what the song is saying. Like, don't worry about a thing, cause every little thing is gonna be alright. And like whenever I find myself worry worrying, like I I use this as a tool, right? If I find myself worrying, like I would in the past about anything whether it's significant or insignificant or what that's exactly what i think it is really if, whether it is or it isn't is only what i think it is i'll just sing that song in my head or out loud depending on where i am at the time and instantly i forget why i was worried and i let go of it so that's just a technique that i found useful for me you may find it useful for you even if it's not that song, any other song you like that is a have has a happy vibe may work for you. Just if you find yourself worrying, sing that song out loud or in your head. It doesn't matter if you're a good singer or not. It doesn't matter. It just gets you in a good mood. And yeah, so I kind of went into it without actually explaining much. I, I want to keep this video quick here. But yeah, like so many people worry about things unconsciously um just by habit and because of that it's just because it's by nature like some people worry so much it becomes actually a disease and that's how like anxiety disorders are created and myself in the past used to worry a lot because that was what i thought was normal i did not even know that i was worrying like when i was a kid or uh, not when I was really little, but when I when I was a bit older, I used to worry because my mom was like a chronic worrier. She still is. I think she probably is a little less now, maybe because I've like changed myself and that's kind of helping her. Anyway, besides the point. Um, so I just kind of adopted that and felt like it was normal. So maybe if you have a similar thing, like if you're around people that worry a lot, you may pick that up in your childhood or you may you may just worry a lot or not much anyway like even people that don't worry much um like to some degree everybody worries right so it's all something that we we can let go of because worry is just a form of fear and pretty much everybody like everybody i've met um has some kind of fear or multiple fears that's just part of being human and the more we let go of fear, any fear that we have, the more we can live. Like, really, truly live and be present and be free. Like, feeling, like, trapped, like, any way is a psychological thing um, that, because of fear, that's all it is. Like I say in my other videos, like, like the two, like, main emotions really are love and fear. And so we want to just have love and let go of fear. And that's what this process is about, is by increasing your awareness, you're just letting go of things. Like, a lot of growth is just letting go of things. It's not so much you don't have to do a lot of things. You just, um, like, you use things as tools, like meditation um, or, like, breath work or mindfulness or yoga, whatever. Um, there's lots of different things. You're just using that to let go. And that's what happens sometimes when you're kind of going through a lot of stuff and you're um, you're growing internally and you're letting go of things is feelings come up, right? Uh, especially if you're doing like raw food or fasting and that, it makes more things come up quicker and it's more intense. So often anxiety can come up, right? And you feel that and you may feel more anxious than you, than you usually do and you're like, well, I'm anxious because, like, I'm generally not an anxious person now. But sometimes if I find myself feeling anxious, it's because something is coming up um, to be let go of. So the reason things come up also is just because when you become more aware, 
You were literally just becoming more aware of what was already there. So maybe these things were there before, but you were not, you didn't have that level of awareness to know so it wouldn't actually bother you. Doesn't mean it wasn't there. Like most people have all these issues, right? They walk around, they're blind, they're acting on autopilot all the time, and they have like all these things. They may be angry, they may walk a certain way, they look cross. They're not aware that they actually do that. And that's why they keep doing it. But if they were to wake up to that slowly, that may cause like some anxiety in them. And that's why th that feeling is often what holds people back from growing because they experience that fear and they're like, this isn't normal, I shouldn't be feeling this. I need to go back and do what I normally do. And that's why they don't get past it. You have to experience some pain just to let go of things. And it, it, it's a short pain, it's, you let go of it, it's never as bad as you think it is because the mind always imagines things worse than they actually are. Imagines the worst case scenario. A flight or fight response, that's where it's come from. And that is only useful in nature when you need to run for your life if you're being chased by a tiger or something. But in like society, like we don't really need that. But like it's very rare when things really happen like that. Like if you're in a car accident or maybe there's a tsunami or something or whatever, somebody is actually chasing you and they've got a gun whatever like that does happen and in those situations yeah totally like you need that fear but everyday situations we don't we experience that fear anyway because we create like a lot of people pretty much i don't i don't want to say that we do that like to 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 make it sound like um you can't get past that or you can't let go of it no you definitely can because that's what um i see his people doing and myself doing so that's why I'm talking about it here. Anyway, like a lot of people are worrying about things that are so stupid and when you become more aware you realize how stupid they are. <laughs> like why am I like why do you worry like about tomorrow? You don't need to worry about tomorrow ever. You don't need to plan. Just be present. And when tomorrow comes, whatever feels right in the moment will be the right thing. Like, that's the thing, we're always trying to plan and control things in the future and that creates worry because we don't know how things are going to turn out. So it, it kind of, it comes from a fear of uncertainty and the way to overcome that is just to trust. You've just got to trust. You can never know everything. You've just got to trust and the more you trust, um, the more you can just let go because things always work out and something that has helped me like, I don't recommend going into the past, um, let go of the past, and don't look back. Um, like, you can look at good memories to create good feelings if you want to, but, like, why worry about the past or even think about the past? Live now, because you're going to live more fully if you live now. But sometimes, um, if you want to look, it, um, sometimes I will look at the past and see how I've done things successfully before. Um, if I'm feeling like doubtful about the future and I realized that I've always done everything before and even if things seemed like they were kind of a bit chaotic they they always worked out and so that's like it's a stupid fear <laughs> it's a stupid fear to be worried about the future even about really big things that I haven't done before because they still work they always work out they always work out as long as you're present it's when you're you're not present that you're more likely to create situations that aren't favorable because you can't think clearly you can't see everything clearly you're distorted so the best thing is to be present that's to have no fear to let go and yeah that's it for this video anyway guys so just don't worry <laughs> And sing that song if, if you find it helpful. It seriously helps um, me if you're like kind of going through this journey and things come up or sing a different song. Anyway, have a great day. I will see you guys next time.